Hello everyone and welcome to my channel, Time to Cook. I am Chef Christy. All right guys, I'm so glad that you're joining me today because what I'm making is fabulous, delicious, and so, so comforting. I am making a pork chop and cheesy potato casserole. I know, right? Pork chop and cheesy potatoes, you cannot go wrong. So I'm excited to share this recipe with you. Let me go over all these ingredients, but before I do, please subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And if you want to be notified as soon as I upload new delicious recipes, then hit that little notification bell. And also let me know that you like this video by giving me a thumbs up. Okay, so what I have here is six boneless center cut pork chops and I have a half of a cup of chopped onion, one garlic clove, two tablespoons of butter, one cup of a sharp cheddar cheese, one cup of chicken broth, a fourth of a cup of half and half, uh, one can of a cream of chicken soup, and then my spices are just salt and pepper and a little paprika, and then I'm using the Idaho uh, potatoes. I've got three here, but you could use anywhere from three to four potatoes, just depending on how many people you're serving. And I'm just going to season these pork chops with salt and pepper and a little paprika on both sides. Now I used uh, the one cup of chicken broth and then I'm using a fourth of a cup of half and half. But I do want to tell you that you can use one and a fourth cups of just chicken broth. You can use one and a fourth cups of milk. I like to use the chicken broth uh, because it's less calories than just say using all half and half or, or milk. Um, but I do like a little bit of creaminess to my sauce, so that's why I add a fourth of a cup of half and half. And then I'm just going to add my cheese, sprinkling it in gradually. Okay, and then next I'm going to slice my potatoes, and I am using a mandolin. It just is a lot easier, um, but if you don't have one, you can just take a knife and make slices. Just try to make them, uh, about the same the same um, width this is about a fourth of an inch I think and I am leaving the skins on well one I'm lazy and I don't want to peel my potatoes but I like the skins and they do add the fiber and to your potatoes so I'm leaving the skins on okay after I place my pork chops over top of my potatoes then I'm just going to take this cheesy cream sauce and pour over top of everything <laughs> and you do kind of want to jiggle your pan just to make sure that that cheese sauce gets all the way down in those potatoes okay that looks good so now I'm going to cover this and I'm gonna bake this for 30 minutes in a 350 degree oven. Then I'm going to uncover it and bake it for an additional 30 minutes. All right, guys, the pork chops 
and the cheesy potato casserole is done and it looks phenomenal. <laughs> Mm. This pork is so tender. It is so juicy. It's not dried out at all. You guys have got to try this. Mm. And the potatoes are tender and cheesy. This is going to be a hit in your house. Well, thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you have a wonderful day and I will see you soon with more recipes.